you feel like she is a danger to herself or others right now? 24 hours a day. Get the protective order. Mental health clinicians answer what's called a warm line inside the Anne Arundel County Police Department in Maryland. Instead of using the word hotline, we use the word warm line so that anybody can call. Voted the number one crisis intervention team in the world, this department says it's putting mental health first. How can we be helpful to them at that moment while they're in crisis? Just the one from the other day. Yeah. Lieutenant Steve Thomas heads up the police side of the unit. Jen Corbin heads up the mental health side. Officers in patrol can call in for a mobile crisis team. It's their discretion. Anything that's not a traditional crime, it could be homelessness, it could be someone in crisis, it could be a traditional mental health issue. I'm a 91 radio. Lieutenant Thomas says this approach has led to less crime and fewer arrests. You're given an option other than arrest. Plus, it's actually addressing a problem far upstream. Do you think that this unit saved your life? Yeah. Yeah, I know they did. Because like I said, if I'd probably been there a couple times, and like I said, if not by my hand, then by somebody else's hand. Samuel Mason says he'd been arrested more than 50 times. I had an issue, I'm schizophrenic. I thought people were after me. Then he encountered the crisis intervention team. Since I met them, I think I had gotten in trouble one time when I was off my meds. And I ain't been in trouble in like a couple years now. Right now, our community needs someone that they can call when they don't have confidence in the police. And our job right now here, Steve and I's job, is to get them to have faith in police again. Answering the call for a crisis of confidence, too. No problem. Deborah Alfaron, CBS News, Anne Arundel County, Maryland.